Welcome back guys, so we're going to move on now to the first stage of configuration on Sequence Generator Pro. Which I'd say on trial license, I guess I just have to uh, register with something I do have a purchased copy. Okay, so this is what it looks like. We're going to close this off and we're going to move up into the tools menu and we'll go user profile. So I'm going to set mine. My elevation, I believe, is 42 meters. I can put in my. You can get all of this information. Generally, I use Google Maps, and there are different ways to find out to get it in the different formats. Some decimalize the end of it, others don't, which can be a bit of a pain at times. sure how desperately accurate this needs to be so we will hit this as save and that is that bit done so let's see what sort of time we've used up to try to keep these videos a bit short so if we go to tools and I'm just move into the general options I generally have a wee warning that pops up before I run a sequence just to check that everything is done I have smashed countless button off masks by not taking them off the mount and then slewing to my target. Switch off IRs because I have security cameras out my back and if I'm shooting with my modified cannon it can it can see the IR which causes a, like a light pollution effect. Uh, this because I use a digital SLR sometimes I tend to use it during the day and if I forget to change it back to manual mode it generally takes me a lot of head scratching before I realize what's going on so I will put this at the main hard drive where I like to keep my so that is me so I'm probably going to copy this in from another mach from my other machine Let's save me typing it out Down in options, so if I do control A, control C, and we'll just drop that in here, that will make my life a little bit easier. And moving on to sequence options, let's see if I have changed any of the defaults. So, attempt to recover that is a, a wonderful feature that has saved me many a time when a cloud has blown past and caused the guiding to fall over. And I think that's enough for the first video. Thanks for watching.